hello friend today i will discuss the topics chinese elementor theorem first we state the theorem and then we solve a problem so suppose we consider some congruences let x congruence to a1 with modulo m x congruence to a2 with modulo m2 x congruence to a3 modulo m3 and so on x congruence to a m with modulo m sorry ml before solving this problem first to check the coefficient of x here one one for every congruence we see that the coefficient of x one and here one most important point the gcd gcd of mi comma mj is equal to one for i not equal to j if this condition are not satisfied then this congruences have a unit solution or not but this condition satisfy we guarantee that the system of congruences has a unique solution now you solve this type of problem by three step first step one step one let m equal to m1 m2 m3 dot mn that means the congruence modulo m1 m2 m3 mn product of this is equal to m1 say and consider some number b1 is equal to m by m1 b2 m by m2 and so on b n m by m n and step 2 b1 x congruence to 1 with modulo m1 b2 x congruence to 1 with modulo m2 and so on b n x congruence to 1 with modulo m n solving this congruences we get a solution suppose solving this congruences we get a solution x1 solving this we get a solution x2 and similarly for this we get a solution xn step 3 step 3 we get a common solution of this congruences in this and this suppose let x naught be a common solution then we get x naught is equal to a1 b1 x1 a2 b2 x2 a n b n x n 
this is the common solution of the system of linear equation this after solving this problem we get a solution x naught then we find the general solution x is equal to x naught plus nk where k belongs to z integer and m is the product of the moduli m1 m2 m3 mn this that means this solution x naught is a solution of this system of linear equation this but we get a general solution x is equal to x naught plus mk where k is any integer this also a solution of the system of linear equation this now solving a problem and here we consider three system of linear congruences x congruence to 2 with modulo 5 x congruence to 3 with modulo 7 x congruence to 4 with modulo 11 here we apply three step step one step two and step three before solving the problem we write down the notation here a1 equal to 2 a2 equal to 3 a3 equal to 4 m1 equal to 5 m2 equal to 7 m3 equal to 11 now we check the city of m1 m2 sorry this city is equal to 1 similarly the city of m2 m3 1 and the city of m1 m3 1 clear here yeah. m1 5 m27 here yeah, the common solution is 1 therefore the city 1 uh, that means m1 m2 and m3 are relatively co-prime that is we can say the cd of mi comma mj is equal to 1 for i not equal to j this is the very important point the cd of mi comma mj is equal to 1 if this condition does not satisfy it does not guarantee that the system of linear equation have a unique solution or not so this is the main point remind it now and one other point the coefficient of x is 1 here 1 1 this is the rules other so next next we consider step one step one say that m1 equal to m1 m2 m3 that is m1 5 m2 7 m3 11 multiply these three number we get the value 385 let's verify this number now Consider the number d1 m by m1 that is 5 7 11 by 5 that is 77 similarly b2 m by m2 which is 5 7 11 by 7 that is 55 and b3 equal to m by 
3 5 7 11 by 11 which is equal to 35 so step 1 complete now step 2 step 2 we consider the congruence as b1 x congruence to 1 with modulo m1 so we write here b1 b1 is 77 x congruence to 1 with modulo m1 m1 here 5 this now reduce the coefficient of x 77 77 is the multiple of let's check 5 divide 77 1 5 2 that is 5 into 15 is equal to 77 is 70, uh, 75 that means 77 minus 75 is equal to 2 2x because I know this coefficient subtract by multiple of m which is equal to 1 5 next we consider again another congruence is 0 congruence to 5 with modulo 5 because 0 minus 5 divided by 5 that is this relation satisfied now adding this we add we get 2x congruence to 6 with modulo 5 2 divide 6 that is x congruence to 3 modulo 5 so this number this number is the solution which is x1 for this linear congruence similarly we consider for b2x congruence to 1 with modulo 7 b2 is 55 x congruence to 1 with modulo 7 next we reduce this number 55 so 7 into 8 56 this is a multiple of 7 or 7 into 7 49 which is a multiple of 7 so we subtract this number 56 56 minus 55 that is minus x modulo 7 multiply minus 1 x congruence to minus 1 with modulo 7 so this number is x2 finally b3 x3 congruence to 1 with modulo 11 b3 b3 is 35 so 35 x congruence to 1 modulo 11 11 into 3 33 which is subtract from 35 that is 2 x congruence to 1 with modulo 11 again we write 0 congruence to 11 with modulo 11 add 
adding we get 2x 12 model 11 2 divided 12 that is x congruence to 6 modulo 11 this number is x 3 so we get solution here for this congruence x1 for this congruence x2 and for this congruence x3 and we know the common solution so step 2 complete now step 3 step 3 sorry next phase step 3 x0 is equal to a1 b1 x1 a2 b2 x2 a3 b3 x3 we know the value of a1 2 b1 77 x1 3 a2 3 b2 55 x2 minus 1 a3 4 b3 35 x3 6 now calculate we get the value here 11 3 7 so this x0 is a common solution common solution of the system of linear equation this so this is the common solution now we get general solution for the system of linear congruences this now we write x is equal to x naught plus m k x naught is 11 3 7 m in m is equal to 385 which is this m is equal to this m is equal to 385 okay and k is any integer which is the which is the general solution of the above congruences this complete the solution now we for check this solution is wrong or true verify please verify here we consider again x is equal to this is for verification not for example purpose x is equal to suppose 11 3 7 2 modulo 5 so here we see that 11 3 7 minus 2 this is 11 3 5 and which is divisible by 5 because 2 1 3 1 0 3 5 7 2 to 7 that means 1 1 3 7 minus 2 is divisible by 5 so this is the solution which is satisfied this congruence again similarly 1 1 11 minus 3 which is also divisible by 7 please verify and x is equal to 1 1 3 7 minus 4 which is also divisible by 11 that means this is this is the common solution this is the common solution of the given linear 
congruence if we check verify please, another solution here we reduce suppose here k is equal to we take minus 1 minus 1 or the minus 2 suppose minus 2 k is equal to minus 2 so this number reduce 1 3 7 x is equal to 385 into 2 those 17 enjoy 7 now subtract 7 6 3 this is also this is also another solution this is also another common solution of the given linear congruence this is 367 367 is also a solution of this linear congruence so this does not matter a particular solution we get a general solution x is equal to x naught plus mk which is the general solution please now we say something about my channel please subscribe and comment and share my channel your friends and also comment and any problem any doubt about Chinese remainder theorem please comment in my comment box thank you very much bye